just look at the circumference of that pie. I'm pretty sure it's almost two pi times the radius. And that donut, man, how long is that donut? That's one long donut. Bloody marvellous. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, pie. I hope you've had a bloody marvellous day. I certainly have. A hard day marking gently or marking hard, hard at marking. Well, I think you know what I mean. Bloody marvellous. Today's video is some video I shot on Sunday. So today was a lot greyer. I uh, got up uh, relatively early. I'd been out the night, got home at nine, and I decided not to do any social media. <clears throat> and I went to bed quite early. And I uh, got up around seven after more than eight hours sleep. I was feeling very good. I had a class today, a practical at one. And I looked at the weather in the morning and I could see that it was looked like rain, good chance of rain. And also the ground was pretty sodden where we were working. I'd been out there last week and, yeah, it was pretty wet. And it had been raining more since. So I thought it probably wasn't too much uh, value in going out there today. Chances are we'd get rained off. So, and I thought I'd get better value out of, doing some marking for the same students that were doing the practical. So, yep, I decided to uh, call it early and uh, spend the day at home uh, marking. I'm not sure that my call was that right. It did seem to clear up a little bit in the afternoon, but I certainly got a big chunk of marking done. Very pleased with that as I just sat at home and went at it as hard as I could. And... I was marking gently for my students, but I was marking hard <clears throat> in the sense that I was really going for it. So I got two chunks of work uh, marked, which was really good. I'm, I'm very noticing that I'm quite busy at the moment and my social media commitments are taking me well into the morning. Um, it's 1.14 now and... We've still got maybe another half hour to go before we get this one up. So I am sort of looking at um, sort of dialing my social media back a bit just to like get um, some marking and things uh, sorted. Uh, it's the end of semester in ooh, two weeks and we've got a public holiday well, this week and next week and we've got a public holiday on the Monday. So yeah, I think I might just uh, see how I go. And uh, then we'll get the marking done and get everything tidied up. So um, that's pretty much how we're going. Uh, just uh, dialing it back a little bit. So I did a live on um, YouTube tonight. And I'll keep trying to do my lives. But um, because they don't take uh, too much uh, time. They're half an hour for the live. And maybe 15 minutes or so. Um, for the TikTok and half an hour extra for the other one so um, on YouTube so yeah I'm um, just as I say gonna dial it back a little bit and we'll see what happens change is good bloody marvelous alrighty 256 steps I didn't leave the house marking 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 hard 10 hours I reckon 8 to late, or maybe even a little bit after that with a couple of little breaks here and there. 84.4 kegs, I didn't weigh myself this morning. Which of these animals is the largest predator? Put your answer in the comments below the video. A baby stingray is called a pup. Moz42 knew this as he had had some very recent experiences with pups, but they weren't Stingray. But he knew the answer. So that's why he's on the Hall of Fame. Bloody marvellous. Fuel legit.
This has been a Mario presentation, recorded live in our studio at Narawahia, Aotearoa, New Zealand, the land of the long white cloud, a place where Kiwis live in a paradise we like to call God's own country.